Hey y'all, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game. Paper Mario Color Splash, where I took a look at the next area I'm going to to confirm my suspicions, and yeah, I had to come back to Port Prisma to donate some cards to the museum and sell a bunch more, because I'm going to need the space. And also, this is going on. Excuse me, sir. I'd like to volunteer for the rescue squad. I'm small, but I'm fierce. Please. Sorry, kid. Rescue squatting is dangerous work, and we need everyone to pull their own weight. You eat vegetables until you triple in size, and then come see me. Are you kidding me? Ah! Okay. I'm never gonna triple in size, which means I'll never be able to join the rescue squad. That's kind of mean, dude. Damn mechanic. Here's the latest rescue squad info. I am not currently in contact with, in, with all of the rescue squad leaders out in the field. Mario, if you find a rescue squad leader out there, please remind them to report in. All right, well, I guess, uh, hmm. I will come back and help you later if we can. Sup, dudes? Greeny, it's been so long. Are you here because you heard about Piper's letter? Check out how well the seaweed planet is doing. Man, Piper was such a solid dude. He'd always do the stuff that no one else wanted to do. Remember the school play? No one wanted to play the role of the down on his luck potted plant, but Piper was all like, I'll do it. And, every, and he was absolutely amazing. Everyone totally thought he was a real plant. I still don't know how he got all those butterflies to land on him. I guess method acting really works. Aww. Well, that's three colors collected. Three to go? Probably. All right, let's head to the next area. And this is gonna be interesting. Go to the world map. Saving, of course. Uh-oh. The shy bandit. Okay, I can get there pretty quick. Got there. Pretty soon, I'm not gonna be able to catch up to him. I got a little bit lucky there. All right, to Cobalt Base. Let's get started. All right, what kind of colorless spots are we looking at here? That's a big one. That's a big Bowser. Oh, hey, you. Got some good stuff here. How's the thousand coins sound? Sure, I can swing that. I got a bunch of cards. Thanks, and you didn't get them from me. So, yeah, that gave me 30 cards. I'm gonna sort these out. They gave me a few cards that I haven't seen before, and probably a few cards I haven't had access to before. Which is gonna be kind of important. All right, thank you. Hey, there's a Power Star spot to fill in? Wow! Kinda wish I'd save that one for last. Let's fill in Bowser's face here. Slowly but surely. This might be one of, one of the biggest spots in the game to fill in. They were quite creative when they gave it the suck to get it to shape like this. Fortunately, they also gave you a bunch of blue paint nearby because you're gonna go through a lot of it. 
and the cheeks, and the jawline, his, his handsome jawline, and T for one, and T for two. Yeah, I'm almost out of blue paint. There we go. You got the huge hammer. Huge cut knockout hammer. And the huge hurl out ham hurl hammer. Alright, cool. Wanted to make sure that I had space for those cards. Also, they certainly give you a ton of coins for this. In case you need them, I guess. Alright. What kind of completion is that? That is 100%. Fill up my blue paint. We're good to go. Oh hey, that was easy. Oh no, it's a trap. A trap door? Where the heck are we? The floor is covered in water, and it looks like this pipe goes down even deeper. Well, you've seen a pipe or two in your day, Mario. What do you think? We don't have a lot of options here. We certainly don't. In we go. <clears throat> Whoa. It's so quiet. Are we underwater? But we can still breathe. Well, you don't have lungs. Let's get ready to play! Sniff it, or... Whiff it! Sniff it or whiff it, Seabed Edition! That's right, folks, it's that time once again. I'm your host, Sniffit. And our contestant today is, why if it isn't our old friend Mario? There are seven rounds, win at least four of the rounds, and you'll, you'll win the grand prize, a mini paint star. Win all seven rounds, and you'll be invited to participate in a special bonus round. Use the cards you have on hand to answer the questions, and don't forget to paint them. If you're not confident in your answer, you can always pass, but that'll count as an incorrect answer. So are you ready to play? Sure. Alrighty, please make your way to the contestant area. I'll just kind of float over here. Now let's get started. Round one, spinning card. Identify the card that you see. Oh, it's a hammer. Okay. It's a single hammer. Now, please answer using the cards you have in your hand. Okay. I, I, this isn't timed, apparently. Hammer! Let's see how you did. That's a big hammer. Too bad. Ooh, that's a shame. You see, Mario, you're not just playing for the enjoyment of our studio audience and millions around the world. You're playing for your life. Looming over you as a bona fide spike-covered urchin. Every time you lose a round, the urchin's razor-sharp spikes inch a bit closer to that bubble you're in. Sorry about that. It really helps our ratings. You still want to continue, don't you? Sure. What a champ our next round is. Round two. Kelp cards. Well, I can't do the bonus rounds this time. I'm going to have to come and play it again. We're going to show you three cards. You must identify all three. Spin jump. 
worn out and hop slipper, okay. Alright. Spin jump, worn out and hop slipper. Let me get over here. Alright, there's hop slipper. Get over here to my jumps. Spin jump. And a worn out jump. There we go. Color on. Alright, that should do. I got one right. Two right. Three right. So far, so good. Round three. Entwined cards. We're going to show you two cards. Identify both of them. Look closely. All right, triple worn out hammer and an iron hammer. Or a hurl hammer. Uh, please, that okay. So, a triple worn out and a hurl hammer. I'm guessing none of the cards he gave me are actually colored. There's that. And there's that. Let's see what he did. Nice. And also nice. I should get bonus points for having in, having them in the right order. So far so good. Round four. Card roulette. We're gonna show you three cards, identify all three of them. Oh god, okay, big ice flower, big e hammer, and a spike helmet. Spike helmet, ice flower, and a big hurl hammer. There we go. No, big e hammer, I mean. There you go. Let's see how you did. Yes, yes, and yes. Congratulations, that's three correct now. Just one more to clear. Round five. Paint that card. We're going to paint a card right in front of you. You'll need to choose the same card from your hand and then paint it the same amount as we painted ours. Oh, okay. The turnip, huh? Now please answer using the cards you have in your hand. I wonder if he would have given me a turn up card if I didn't have one. Alright. Hang on a sec. I gotta be precise here. There we go. That looks right. I even got the spots. Let's see how you did. Perfect. Congratulations, you've won four rounds and have secured your prize. Now, you didn't complete a perfect game today, but there's always next time. Come back on the show, complete a perfect game, and secure your place in Sniff It or Whiff It history. You'll win a sweet prize, too. Until we meet again, Mario, and for all of you watching at home, we'll see you next time on... Sniff it or with it. All right. Well, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and take a cut here. And when I get past to paint that card, if I'm doing a perfect round, we'll keep going from there. Awesome. There's our paint star. So I will see you in a few minutes. Well, a few minutes for you, forever for me.
refill all my paint. Congratulations, that's four right answers in a row with no misses. You've already secured your prize, but keep going and try to get every question right for a shot at that legendary prize. I'm kind of really annoyed with this game show right now. All right, card roulette. Um, it turns out that once you win or once you leave the course, the answers completely change. So you, if you want a, a guaranteed shot at having all the cards that you'll need, you need to buy them every time. So what I did was, I've got to save right before I go in. That, and if I fail, I restart. We're going to show you three cards, so identify all three of them. Interestingly enough, that means like the answers haven't changed, but I've gotten a few wrong. Yeah, Spiny, Spin Jump, and Spike Hammer. This is the same as it was last time. Spiny, Spin Jump, and Spike Hammer. Or Spike Helmet, not Spike Hammer. All right. Uh, spike helmet, spin jump, spiny. But I've been doing this for a little bit, and like, the appeal of the game is nice, but I am so sick of doing it. <laughs> I really am. So far, so good. Round six! Following cards! We're going to show you three cards, identify all three. Big hammer, eek hammer, hurl hammer. Yep, same as it was last time. Alright, big hammer, hurl hammer, eek hammer. There's the big hammer. Uh, Eek Hammer, Pearl Hammer. All right, now I color them. Color it. There we go. Big Hammer, Pearl Hammer, or Eek Hammer, and Pearl Hammer. There we go. I should get bonus points for getting them in the right order. Incredible! You've won all six rounds so far! Here we go, our seventh round! Get this one right, and you'll earn the right to try the bonus round, good luck! Round seven! Card recall! First, we'll show you four cards, remember all of them. Swoop, pow, big knockout, fire flower. Okay, swoop, pow, big knockout, fire flower. Swoop, pal, big knockout. All right, so it's the pal block that's missing. That answered, the cards didn't change, but that answer did. It's the pal block that's missing. Yay! Congratulations, you busted all seven rounds. Well, Mr. Perfect, you've earned the right to challenge the bonus round. Get all three questions correct and you'll receive an extravagant legendary prize you can't find anywhere else. But get, get even one wrong and it's an instant game over and your save file will be erased forever. Just kidding. But seriously, if you get one wrong, it will be game over and you won't get credit for clearing the other rounds. You in? Sure. I will cheat if I have to. Of course you are. Here we go. Bonus round part one. Following cards two. We're going to show you three cards and defile three. Good luck. Double hammer, big hop slipper, iron jump. <sighs> big hop slipper, double hammer, iron jump. Let's see how you did. Double hammer. Big hop. Iron jump. Great work, let's keep it going. 
You're running low on paint. Yes, I will buy some. Thank you. Fill her up. Bonus round part two. Count cards too. We're gonna show you three cards. Identify all three. Good luck. One out hammer, ice flowers, fuzzy. One out hammer, ice flower, fuzzy. One out hammer, ice flower, fuzzy. One out hammer, ice flower, fuzzy. All right. There's the fuzzy, worn out hammer. Is this? That's a fire flower. I need a nice flower. I'll use that one. I use one that's pre-colored so I make sure I know it's a fire or an ice flower. Let's see how you did. One out, fuzzy, and the ice flower. Bingo, bingo. All right. Last round. I will cheat for this. This is it, folks. The final question of the bonus round. Bonus round part three. Card recall two. First, we'll show you three cards. Try to remember everything about the following scene. Okay, which card was the blooper holding? Hang on here. I am opening something. I'm opening another program and expand the canvas. All right, there we go. The blooper is holding a hop slipper. <laughs> I took a print screen there. All right, the blooper is holding. It's not a great. Yeah, it's a normal hop slipper. There we go. Let me triple check here. Shy Guy had the big e hammer, Cheap Cheap had the double jump, and Blooper had the hop slipper. Yes. Uh, that is my final answer. Let's see how you did. Yes! <laughs> I'm free! <laughs> oh, I don't have to do this anymore. Incredible! You cleared the bonus round! Congratulations, Mario! You are our newest- You are our newest Sniff It or Whiff It champion! Now go and claim your legendary prize! Until we meet again, Mario, and for all of you watching at home, we'll see you next time on... Sniff It or... Whiff It! Bye, everybody! My planet needs me! Congratulations on winning the legendary prize. Squeeze it as hard as you like. And yes, I will need this at some point. You absolutely have to do a perfect 10 round because you will need this for a boss fight. Otherwise, you are doomed. You got instant camera, the future of personal photography. Selfie's so real, you'll begin to question reality itself. If you have this in your inventory, uh, they will give you cards with with their selfies on it, but you don't you never see them. They don't exist, you never see them. It's just kind of implied. I'm not doing 10 rounds to show that. Screw that. I got what I needed. I'm I'm out of here. Goodbye. <laughs> There we go. Alright, it's a little bit late. We're kind of at an awkward thing. It's only been about a half an hour. I could end the episode, but I do want to go try... Uh, this... Rochambeau, Temple Number 3. So let's do that. Hope for the best. Probably get the worst. Rochambeau, no Temple Number 3. Welcome to Rochambeau, temple number three. Sorry, don't mind me, I'm checking something here. Okay. J 
just making sure I had a certain window available to me. All right, let's see here. What are my hints? The first round opponents like the papery sound they make when they all wrestle together. They don't like hard things. So they're gonna use paper or scissors? So I would use scissors. Okay. The second round opponent's hands are all soggy and flat. Okay, so he mostly uses paper then. Uh... Hang on a second here. Alright. Yeah, so the first one uses scissors or paper. Both of them use scissors or paper. Uh, okay. If you get a paint star, you can enter a Rochambeau temple. If you get a paint star, you can enter a Rochambeau tournament at any of the temples. Neat, huh? Oh, so you have to get a big paint star to enter any tournament. It's not many paint stars. You probably already know this, but if there's a toad guarding the main door of a temple, you can't enter the Rochambeau tournament. I mean, I can bribe my way in. I've done it before. Did you know each of the Rochambeau temples has their own has its own cafe? My dream is to eat at all of them. They're all identical. And actually the first item the hearty latte heals your health. The prisma juice uh gives you full paint. All right, let's give this a shot. Let's kind of go out on a win, I hope. The game of Rochambeau is a dark forest of self-doubt home to ravenous beasts that prey on your deepest fears and insecurities. With only three weapons at their disposal, are these warriors destined for glory or eternal embarrassment? This is the art of Rochambeau! Super Rochambeau! And with that, the competitors will take the stage. In this corner, the up-and-coming foreigner with the lightning-fast fingers, Mr. Mamma Mia himself, Mario! And in this corner, with 10 hollow eyes, 20 wriggling limbs, and the self-esteem of half a Goomba, it's a sh Shy Guy 5-Stack! Round one, Mario versus Shy Guy Five Stack. Challengers, set your cards. All right, use scissors for the first two rounds for your best shot at winning. Row, sham, boat. That's one. Mario! Here's your prize for making it through the first round. 500 coins! Your second round opponent approaches. As if he couldn't get any more miserable, he's the damp duelist, the clammy combatant, soggy guy! Round two, Mario versus Soggy Guy. Challengers, draw your cards. All right, same strat, scissors. Noom. Row, sham, bow. Mario. Here's your prize for making it through the second round. 700 coins. Bye, soggy guy. Mario, only one opponent stands between you and eternal glory. He's the freaky cave dwelling loner with a terrible posture. He can't be hammered or stopped. He's... Sun guy! 
Final round, Mario versus Shandy Guy. Challengers, start. Set your cards. Uh, I'm gonna go Rock here, I think. I think this is still random. Let's hope for a solid victory. Bro, Sham, Bo. Rock versus Rock. A tie. Challengers back to your marks. All right. Uh, go paper. Bro, Sham, Bo. Yes. <laughs> Mario! Victory! You are our tournament champion! You'll be going home with a fat bag of coins and a brand new card! Hey, the teapot re replica! And a thousand coins! All of which are going to waste. <laughs> That's a wrap, folks. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Hi, everybody. So we have victories in the first three Rochambeau temples, at least. You won! Congratulations! And we're gonna call it an episode here. Congratulations for winning the tournament of Roshan Boat Temple number three. Thank you guys so much for joining me. As always, I appreciate it. If you enjoyed what you saw, let me know. Give me likes, leave me comments. Remember to subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, where we have no more game shows. <laughs> Anyways, y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.